What up guys, I'm your boy Jay Toons, and welcome back to my Minecraft series. Now in the last episode, we were working on this trap area and I've showed you, you know, we worked a little bit on this and I'm going to show you what I've done off camera, which is a lot. I mean, I've done a lot with this trap and area off camera. I'm going to show you everything. So, um, what I've done so far guys is added in all of the iron bars all the way around here. I have some chests here already. I have, you know, cleared out all the nether brick, added in the iron bars on every single side except for right here I ran out of iron bars of course this takes a lot of nights of AFK and getting that iron to do this I'm gonna have to do it yet again um, uh, again after uh, I'm done here and, and tonight and, and be able to uh, you know get some more iron to finish off this area but I've done a whole bunch of stuff I'm gonna go ahead and show you everything that I've done and then we can go yeah I'm gonna show you everything I've done so I did all the iron, uh, you know, bars here, and I also have a room there that I'm going to show you, but what I've done here is I put in ladders here to get up to the area that we're in right now, which is, well, the area that we have our stuff smelting, which is going to be removed once I'm able to move everything. The problem is, as of right now, I have a whole bunch of stuff here still smelting the nether brick and stuff I have nether brick for days those chests down there are filled this stuff's up here this has all been slabbed here so things can't spawn I'm also uh I have trees growing here which I'm going to show you that I've been getting coal and that's how I'm smelting that down because I haven't gone to do any type of mining um but yeah, as you guys can see, I've done all the clearing here on uh, every single side uh, except for right here. This is going to be either um, either we're going to clear this out and fill this in with uh, another brick or uh, another rack, excuse me, or I'm just going to leave it slabbed and remove all the stuff and then enclose the rest of this area once I'm done. I am going to have this ladder going all the way to the top as, as it is right there. So and then we can actually get to the roof if we need to. Um, there's actually a skeleton in here right now. I have been doing a lot of stuff to this, so now I am seeing a little bit more of the mobs uh, spawning and falling down here to kill, which is good. It's not still at 100% yet, but it is getting a little bit better. Now, I'm going to go ahead and show you the rest of the stuff that I've done. So you guys saw this here. We have a way to get back up. Now, I've already made this little room here. It's a safe room, basically. Um... And this is actually probably where we're going to be sitting while we're AFKing as well because I did notice something with this trap that magna cubes, the ones that do, the little baby ones that do fall through here, they are able to fall through. They don't die on first impact and then they're able to jump around here. So uh, most likely once this is up and running properly and we need to AFK, I'll just AFK in this room because here it is safe. There is slabs, every well I think it's safe. This is completely slabbed here, so nothing can really spawn, and there's a slab right there. But anyway, let me go ahead and show you what I've done. I've added in a rail system here, and this takes us right up to, um, you know, the to the, the main fortress here that I've already started slabbing. As you guys can see, this is all slabbed. Yes, I have slab. Oops, hit the mouse the wrong way. Uh, I have slabbed this whole area here. This goes all the way, and I'm going to show you everything that I've done. I know I've done a lot off camera, but this is a lot of the boring stuff and the stuff that I'm trying just to get this trap to be somewhat efficient, guys. So I've slabbed all this area here. I've gone up to here, uh, slabbed all this up. This is all slabbed here. Um, we also have slabs. Let's see here. Um, I, I just slabbed this whole area up. The slabs aren't completely going back to our main rail. This, uh, this walkway or whatever that we're on right now, and this railwood eventually is going to take us to our hub rail, which takes us back to our nether hub, um, or our portal hub, and then it'll take us back home. But, uh, I stopped right here, but up to this point here, it is, um, slabbed. I will continue slabbing the rest of this once, uh, you know, once I'm at that point there, but as of right now, I don't have any more iron, no more rails, no more power rails to continue doing this. Um, so uh, I stopped it here with the slabs, but I did slab it up to this point, and I've done a lot of other things off camera, which I'm going to show you uh, right now. Um, so all this has been, as you guys can see here, has been slabbed. Also, I did go down that way already. I've also, of course, uh, slabbed this here and I've also slabbed this here and I didn't even know about this until I started slabbing and this I slabbed all the way up um all the way through here is slabbed um the, everything is slabbed so nothing is spawning up here anymore uh this is slabbed as well and this goes up so high this is also slabbed here 
and everything is just slab. There's nothing else. And also, even where the hell is the lava? Over here. I did miss a spot here, which I'm going to have to come back to at a later time. I just finished slabbing this a little bit ago. Let me go ahead and remove that there. But um, there is lava, and wherever there's lava, nothing will spawn. I did slab this area, but that part right there, I don't know if we can get through it from another way, or if that even matters there, but I can use an ender pearl to get over there and then slab it if it's necessary. Um... But for right now, we're going to leave it as it is. Uh, I don't know if it's going to affect or anything, but this is all slabbed, and then we'll we'll see. If I, you know, once we have everything up to where I need it to be, and I see that it's, you know, if it's not working, then I'll come back and slab this area, because of course I know exactly uh, where that spot is. Um, oh my goodness, I need to find my way out. Um... I have a lot of plans here, guys, and I know I, I said in the last episode that we're going to be starting to work on other projects, but I've, I've spent so much time working on this, I want to show you this, and I'm trying to get this to, to a point where it's actually ef efficient, uh, basically. But the other stuff that I've done off camera, if you guys remember here... It used to be the Nether Fortress, right? It used to continue going out that way. I've cleared all of that out, and I've used these blocks. That's how I got my slabs, actually. I used those blocks to uh, make my slabs. I've slabbed this whole sidewalk. It runs all the way to our Wither Crusher, which we are going to be saving. Um... Also, we had a fortress that came, of course, all the way up to this point here, which I have destroyed most of it, so I could put up my iron here, or my bars here. I've destroyed most of it up to here, and then the rest of it's all slabbed. I've also done the other side. I, I've slabbed up there, as you guys can see already. That's already slabbed as well. And I want to show you... Um, I'm just going to show you everything and then we'll actually get into what I want to do here, which I think is going to be pretty cool. And then you guys can let me know what you think about it, of course. But if I come right over here, um, oh, and somebody, something's in there. You guys can hear the pistons going. Let's shoot this over here. I've slabbed this whole area up here that, of course, has lava, um, so there's no worries there. I'm going to have to put in some nether uh, brick or uh, not. I keep saying brick, but nether rack uh, here. Um, to close this off because there's no need to slab that. We can just close it off with another uh, rack and we wouldn't have a problem. But I've slabbed up to this whole area up to here. I didn't go all the way, of course, because I'm going to do other stuff back there that I have an idea for. But all this has been slabbed as well. So let's go ahead and get uh, going with a couple of things that I want to do here. Uh, I'm actually going to go up this way. If I shoot that there... Oh my god, I thought I fell down. Um, let's go around this way uh, because there's a couple things that I want to do. Now, in the last episode, I had showed you guys that we got um, two... I got two uh, Wither Skulls while doing this. And I've been spending a lot of time out here. As you guys can see, I've been putting in a lot of work here. And I was able to get... Uh, another skull so we are gonna be killing a wither here really quick and that way I can show you um, I can show you what else I want to do with this project and I can uh, yeah so there's a lot that I, I need to show you guys and, and a lot that I want to get going with here so let me go ahead and go grab those wither skulls I should have grabbed them earlier but then we'll go to the crusher because I've done a lot to the crusher as well um, so there's a lot of things going on here uh, that I've done off camera. I know guys. I know I, I do apologize that I you know I said I wanted to stream it um, And I just I'm not able to I still have my ISP guys out here trying to fix stuff They now have maintenance uh, like cutting down um, You know digging up the lines and checking out the lines to see what the hell the issue is my internet is not working So as soon as it does start working again, I will be able to uh, Oh, there's a wither. There's a wither uh, skeleton right in there so as you guys can see, it is working. Damn, my food is completely ran out. I've eaten up all my steaks. This is it. This is about all the food that I have. Um, I wonder if we'll get another one here. But as you guys can see, it is starting to work here. And look at that, another skull. So um, yeah, it's just, it's going to be lovely. It's awesome. Oh, damn it. I forgot to get my um, my uh, my soul sand. But um, like I said, guys, I do want to stream this. I wanted to be able to stream this, and that was my plan to go with this series was to, you know, things that I do off camera to stream it for you guys because I know you guys enjoy it. Hopefully, you guys aren't too upset with me. It's not really my fault. Um, I am trying to get my internet sorted, um, and I will be streaming these things that I do off camera because to do all this on camera is actually quite a bit, and I under, you know, it does get a bit boring, and that's the reason why I've been doing it off camera. I'm just showing you everything now, and then we're also going to get onto something pretty cool. Now, after we're done with today's episode, I think pretty much I'll be doing every, the rest of it off camera. Of course, I'll show you the progress like I'm doing now, but I think we're going to start working on other projects as well because this is just, we've been wasting, not wasting, but we've been spending a lot of time down here, and I know a lot of people are getting sick of seeing the nether. Um, I'm, 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 
I'm terribly sick of this, to be honest, of being here. Oh, no. No! Um, I'm really sick of being here, uh, and I can't wait till I don't have to come up here no more to deal with these guys. Damn it! Did he break it? Oh, no, no, we're good. Um, he didn't break anything um, too important. But um, here we go. We're going to place this here. Oh, my goodness. Another one. Another one. Hit it, hit it. Yes. Yes, so I've made this sidewalk here, guys. Uh, or a bridge area because there's going to be something cool that I want to do with this. Uh, but this is all slabbed, of course, so nothing can spawn on top of this a sidewalk here. And this is going to take us all the way to our crusher, which our crusher is right up here. And I have also already slabbed, as you guys can see, I slabbed my way all the way up to our crusher. Now, the reason I did this is because we have to do from our trap 140, and I know I talk about this all the time, but 140 blocks in radius around our trap that nothing can spawn, otherwise the, the trap is not that efficient. Now, of course, I know I'm going to miss some spots that things can spawn, but I've, I've been working here, guys. I've been working like crazy. I've slabbed this whole area up. There was a hell of a lot of pigment in this area here. Uh, I've slabbed this whole area up, as you guys can see. Nothing can spawn up here anymore. Um, and the I still have the crusher area, which is right here, still to do our job, which is pretty cool because we are going to be keeping this area here. And um, it's just easier like this, especially with the trap there. And then we have the crusher right here. So all we have to do for this uh, is to do this really quick. And I know a lot of you guys don't like the way I do this. Um, you guys actually want to see the real wither fight without this uh, trap here and I might do one of them um, uh, you know a regular fight I'm not gonna do it in this area because I've done so much work to it we might get to it um, one of the wither fights um, some other time but for right now I'm just going to do it this way now if I jump right up here he can't get out we, we kill him with this we get the nether star and, and we can make the beacons now this is the main reason why I'm doing this trap yes the gold is good because I actually got a whole bunch of gold already from pigmen falling in there and crushing them and dying them and and dying them and dying and I've gotten uh, nuggets from them and been able to Ooh, there's what I wanted thank you very much um you know, I, I've gotten, uh, I, that's how I made most of my power rails that we got for this is actually from the pigmen that are falling in there. Every time they fall in there, I crush them. Um, and of course, I had more gold. It's not all from pigmen, but uh, we are going to be getting gold and fire rods and everything from this trap that we're making. But the main reason is for these uh, nether stars. So then we can make a bunch of beacons and make our city look freaking legit. I want my city to be amazing. I want it to look modern. I think these beacons are going to help it. And also, we're going to have beacons around this area. Like if we're building here, if I had haste two right now in this area, it would help so much. And look, we got a, a baby pigment on a chicken. Nice. All right, cool. Now that we've taken care of that, I do want to go ahead and explain and show you the idea that I have for this area. And as you guys can see right here, I have been growing trees um, out here. Um, you know, they do grow. They grow pretty damn slow, but they do grow. But I've been grabbing the the uh, the wood and, and smelting that or burning that into charcoal. And that's what I've been using to, um, to smelt... Um, down the nether brick and glass and everything else uh, I've been using that because I haven't gone to mine at all um, since I've been here I've been in the overworld for the longest times I only head to the house when I run out of material I need to go check on something or get food or something like that and this is all the food that we have I've used like I said all my steaks and everything up uh, I'm still breeding um, you know we still have a lot of we still have I'm breeding the cows and stuff so my supply is low but as soon as we're done here I will be getting my supply back up and running properly all right what i want to do real quick and i don't even know why the hell i came this far up here but let's go ahead and just drop this stuff off here uh what the hell did i want to grab here um we got this here okay i got this what i needed i can leave this here as well do i need anything else from up here i don't think so um no we're good okay what i want to do i, I didn't want to come up here uh but either way oh there goes another skelly um so as you guys can see, the trap is, now that I've done some type of slabbing and taking care of some of the spawnable areas, we are starting to get mobs in here. Of course, it's not where it's supposed to be, but it will be shortly, I'm hoping. All right, guys. So I was thinking, of course, I did slab up some area and it was taking a, a lot of material and a lot of time. And then I was thinking, you know what? We could do lava instead, right? We could use some lava and that's exactly what we're going to do. Um, there's ponds of lava here and there and on the other side of the trap when I started digging that area out to put in the track I saw there was an ocean of lava there so what we're gonna do I went back home picked up some buckets here and what we're gonna do is grab this lava now we can't make an infinite source of lava of course but we can grab the lava that's here 
uh, fill up our buckets, and we're gonna make a uh, an ocean, basically, of lava uh, for our trap. And I'm hoping it's gonna work. I think it's gonna work. Um, uh oh. I think it's gonna work. Uh, I'm hoping it's gonna work, to be honest, and I think it will, to be real. But I'm gonna show you exactly, and we're gonna start working on this lava ocean, which uh, is gonna help us out. Um, it'll save us time. It's still gonna be um, a pain in the ass to do. Don't get me wrong. Uh, either putting down blocks or, or, or laying lava or water to fill in an area um, takes ages. But and and working with lava is dangerous. Uh, we could die at any moment. We can lose tools. Uh, but I think it's gonna be the best, and also. I just think it's going to look cool, to be honest, to have a ocean or, you know, oceans and waterfalls of lava coming to the... Ooh, chicken. Um, coming to this area here, and we just have a sidewalk to go to our crusher. So, uh, what I want to do... Uh, hopefully, I do have some slabs on me, because I've already checked, and, you know, I scouted out some of the areas, of course. But, right up here, we're going to start with the top part before we even mess with this bottom part here. So, let's go ahead, and I do have some slabs, so that's good. Oh, I had some ender pearls as well. Um, do I have everything? I do. Alright, let's go ahead and shoot our ender pearl up there. It should make it. There we go. Right to the top. And as you guys can see here, we have an issue because we have, uh, things spawning up here. And we need to clear this out. And we also have an area up here where they're spawning. Here, what I'm going to do, because it is such a, um, a little area, I will slab this area out, okay? We are gonna slab this area out here. Um... So let me just go ahead. Oh, come on, baby. We are going to put slabs in here. So let's go ahead and start doing this. And then we're going to start with our, our river or ocean of lava and also our lava falls, which I think is going to be pretty cool. Um, you know, I, I, I think it's going to look cool in the end. Hopefully it is going to. Um, I've never really tried to do this. Uh, I wish we could bring water here and that would stop things from spawning. But as you guys know, the nether does not allow any water. Water does not work out here in hell. Um, so... We are gonna, oh man, I have to slab every little, every little block has to be slabbed, otherwise they can spawn and destroy um, our spawn rate. Especially, um, like I said guys, I know I'm probably gonna miss some spots, don't get me wrong, there's no way in hell. I know there's probably, in places that look solid, there's probably caves and caverns um, where things are spawning, but I'm gonna try to get every inch that I can. Um, I also thought about blowing up the area, but that's going to take even longer. Uh, we could do that with beds. We could do that with TNT and stuff, but I just feel like it's going to take ages and it's dangerous as hell because we could blow it up, fall into an ocean of lava and die and lose our stuff. And I think this way might be cooler. Uh, right now this is actually quite boring, but this is another reason why I decided to, to try out the lava thing because I was slabbing like this and this takes ages. You know what I'm saying? Um, just to get... Every single block like this is is pretty much insane. Uh, so let's go ahead and get started with this. And what I want to do is first off, we're going to just jump right here. And all we're going to do is pick a spot, any spot. And this spot right here looks amazing to start. What we're going to do is just grab our lava, guys. We're going to grab our lava, uh, place it about here. It should spread into three things like water. There we go. So it spreads like water, but it can kill us. So we got to be careful. We got to be hella careful, actually. Um, and what we're going to do is we will be breaking, um, we will be breaking blocks. Uh, like, okay, I'll try to explain this. So what we're going to do is place this here. Uh, it's going to spread. And once it stops, we'll knock down some of the, the nether rack and make it so it continues flowing. Um, like right here. Like I already kind of messed up here because, well, I can just do this. Let's go ahead and I can explain it with this section right here. So as you guys can see, the lava did stop flowing. Oh. The lava did stop flowing here. So what I'm going to do uh, is just remove some blocks here, yeah? We'll remove some blocks just like this. Um, and this way, right? we do this uh, like this and like this. I need to get up here so I don't kill myself. And do like this. And that way, the lava will continue, hopefully, and cover every single block. And also, because it's a waterfall, it's going to start covering the stuff down there as well. If I calculated this properly, which I probably didn't. Oh, shh. See what I'm saying? Lava is dangerous, baby. Lava is dangerous. But this is what we're going to do. We're going to have it go out. And then we will extend, of course, this area here. Um, like this and stuff like this. Uh, and, and, and work on the waterfall uh, or the lava fall uh, experience. So, um, the quartz I will be picking up. I wish I would have brought my fortune pick with us now also guys uh with all the work that i've done out here i have of course repaired uh my diamonds are down to maybe uh one more it's not even a full stack it's a little bit of diamonds left um 
I've been repairing diamonds, uh, or diamonds. I've been repairing. I've been, uh, damn, I should have brought some nether rack with us. I've been repairing. I have been, um, also enchanting. As you guys can see here, I have a bunch of the same types of picks. I've been enchanting a lot, uh, to, to help me clear this because my tools kept on getting really low. So I've done a bunch of that. I've done a lot of things off cameras and I'm actually disappointed that I've done so much off camera, but I know a lot of you guys, uh, you know, don't really want to see, some of you guys, I understand, want to see everything, but it's not its not possible, guys. It's so much time that's thats spent uh, just doing this, and I know it, it's going to bore some people. Even this right here might be boring, you guys, but I'm trying to get, I'm trying to get everything um, situated here, right? Uh-oh, got to be careful. Got to be careful. Trying to get everything situated here, trying to get our... Um, our, our trap that I've been wasting so much time on to work and especially after doing all this work I want the thing to work as as much like I, I really want it to work like that's that's the only thing that's been on my mind for the last couple of days so I'm just gonna place that there that should spread pretty well there I think and we got to keep on making sure that we're getting it there we go see what I'm saying we got to make sure that it's covering up every single block it cannot leave one block will have everything spawning on it so we can't have that I will go ahead and um, do this here. So, um, yeah, this is pretty much the idea that I have here. And I'm going to end up doing a lot of this stuff, you know, off camera, of course. I'm just showing you guys. And maybe you guys have an even easier way or a better way to do this. Um, you know what I'm saying? Um, but, yeah, uh, as of right now, this is how we're going to be doing. This is what lava and, you know, maybe, maybe slabbing is better. I just, it wastes a lot of material. Um, and we have like basically, in, especially in the nether, we have an infinite source of lava. So I think this is probably the, the better way. I don't know if it's a smarter way, but it's definitely the better way. So we don't waste our materials, um, right? That, so we don't waste our materials. So I'm just going to go ahead and do this again. Just popping that there, making sure that I get it in between three blocks. And there we go. So um, like this. And what we'll keep on doing. Uh-oh. Um, we're just going to place this here and then we'll worry about. Uh-oh, that might be a problem okay i filled it in i filled it in in time and what i'm gonna do here is remove this here and that should there it is spread that down a little bit uh just like that and we have a couple more blocks here and then we'll run back down to our pond um and pick up our so right there just making sure that i get in between every single and i gotta make sure that i don't get caught on fire either um hmm how do i want to do this there's uh well i know exactly what i'm gonna do here i'm just gonna fill this in uh, that's probably the smartest thing to do here. Uh, we'll fill this area in so things can't spawn. And if I can't fill it in, then I'll just slab it. And then the lava will be behind it. And then we'll just do it right here like this. And I am going to go get some nether rack here as soon as we have to go back down to refill our buckets here um, to do this. So let's go ahead and I will be removing nether rack and, and stuff and trying to make this man-made uh, lava ocean the best that I can. Again... Massive project, I know, but I think in the long run too with the sidewalk and stuff, it's going to look pretty damn cool, um, you know, walking through a lava uh, walkway um, that, you know, mobs can't spawn on all the way, uh, all the way to our crusher and uh, back to our, our little, um, you know, to the fortress where we can get back down. So um, let's go ahead and uh, use our pearl here. Oh, I still have more pearls here. Um, let's jump down here. Uh, let's go get some more lava, of course, and I can just toss it over there. Um, yeah, so it's working out. As you guys can see, the waterfall or the lava fall is actually working. And then I know for a fact that I'm going to have to come back here and add in some lava buckets in the back. But what we're going to do is do the same thing. We're going to like right here in this area here where it stops, we'll cut down the nether uh, rack and make it like stairs. So then the, the lava keeps flowing until it gets to this part here. It's going to be a lot of work. It's going to be better than slabbing in my opinion. Um, but yeah, it's, it, like I said, it is going to take a lot of work and a lot of time that I'm most likely going to end up working on off camera, guys. I'm going to um, continue working on it off camera unless, uh, you know, uh, by some type of miracle, my internet starts working again properly and I can stream it, then I will stream it. But um, yeah, the past the past couple of uh, weeks have been horrendous for me and um, and I haven't been able to do what I need to do because of, of my internet. But as soon as it does get fixed... Um, things will get be getting back to normal, um, you know, and I, I miss doing the, the mini games. That's another thing too. I usually put out mini games on my channel on the weekends and I'm not even able to do that um, because I lag up and stuff and even trying to, I try other games as well and I still, um, you know, the internet works enough where I can 
check my email and it takes hours to upload but um it's just it's unbelievable what the hell's going on with my I don't know what the hell it is to be real they keep on giving me so many different excuses but it doesn't work so as soon as it gets fixed um everything will go back to normal guys and I really do miss streaming because streaming was hella fun as well uh but yeah I haven't been able to put out mini games I haven't been able to really do anything that I like to do um because of my internet issue so I got the lava oh I forgot to grab let me just run right back down here and I think this is the coolest thing here. Like, I've been here for the longest time, and every time I get on here, I get excited when I'm riding this little uh, rail um, or roller coaster. Whatever you want to call it. It's a rail, I know, but what are you doing? Where the hell did you fall from? Did you spawn up there, buddy? You probably spawned right there. How did you get in here? Oh, you came from over there. I understand. I'll kill your ass later once I close that off so they can't get us. All right, I need to grab some nether rack just to close up some holes. Um, so let's go ahead and grab that now. And I think, you know what, I might actually need some more slabs, so we'll grab some slabs as well. Um, so let's do this. Let's grab one stack of this, which I'll be grabbing more, of course, or getting more as we start clearing. Um, I'm going to leave this one here. No, no, I want to switch. Okay, that's good there. Um, why the hell do I have feathers? Uh, oh, chickens or something. Um, I'll leave this here as well for now. And I'll also leave the... No, I might need that. Uh, so much things in my bag right now, but I need most of it. Okay, let's head back up and continue working on this lava fall here. Um, yeah, and I'm going to end up doing this everywhere around here. And most likely down there as well, we're going to have to... I'm going to first worry about like adding lava and slabbing up in this area first. And our tree just grew in. That's lovely. Um, and then from there, I will, um, you know, worry about the downstairs. And most likely if the lava thing starts working here, fine. Um, oh shit. Um, if that starts working here. No, 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 no. Yo, can you leave me alone? Does it blow up my tree? Oh, it does blow up my tree. Damn it. Okay. I hate these things with a passion, man. These guys are so annoying. No, it blew up my dirt block, you piece of junk. It's okay. It's all right. Um. Yeah, anyway, let's go ahead and start working on some more of this stuff up here. So all I need to do is toss my ender pearl. Pew! Uh-oh, I think I missed. No, I got it. I got it. Um, I'm going to continue working on this here, guys. Uh, same way we're doing it here. Um, like I said, if I need to fill in anything, we will. Damn, the chicken sucks. With steak, you last so much longer on the hunger. Let me just make sure it is the unbreaking... Um, all right, so let's continue doing this here. Uh, I'm gonna widen it up a little bit It's just easier this way. So and then you can just you know one two three you put that there it does that We go like this and then one two three and we place that there and got to be careful that we don't get caught um, You know uh, Just like this a little bit and that way everything is oh see there's one block there Got to keep making sure that we're getting everything can't have not even one block open for this man this is the hard part. This is what I've been talking about that was going to be tedious and and long and, oh my god, it's just forever to do this. But, uh, like I said, guys, the way that I see the, the wither skeletons falling and the blazes and stuff, once this is full, uh, full fully efficient, I think it's going to be hella worth it and um, super excited. And when you guys download the world and, and once this is all done, I will have a world download as usual. I think it's going to be real cool for you guys to be able to get whatever you need. Beacons, uh, blaze rods, all in one trap. You know what I'm saying? I think it's going to be um, a pretty cool experience. Um, again, that could be just my opinion, but I think it's going to be pretty good. All right, what I'm going to do is maybe here, maybe I think about here. Um, I don't want to be knocking down. I just want to kind of go with the land, basically. But, um, all right, that's filling up there. Yeah, you know what? I'm going to stop, like, knocking things down. I think I'm just going to skip three here. Place one maybe here. Hopefully, that the thing is, if it doesn't fill it on the other side, then it messes everything up. You know what I'm saying? Like, I don't know if it got that. I don't think it did. Nope, maybe it did. Maybe it did get that one block. Got to go ahead and make sure... And this is why I said I might do the rest of this, you know, on stream if my internet gets fixed or I'm going to end up doing it off camera because I do have to do a lot of checking to make sure that um, we're not missing a spot or something like that. All right, guys. So uh, just going to put these buckets here, place this here. And what I'm going to do is this should be the third one about here. And I want to do it up higher. Oh, man, if you do it up higher, though, I think I just failed there. If I don't open it up on either side, then it's not going to get it on that side, is it? Oh, goodness. Um, 
Yeah, actually, you know what? This is what I'm going to do for this side here. I'll just close that off there. Nothing can spawn there now, and we'll just do that. There we go. Going to continue going with this a little bit more. And actually, yeah, I think I'm going to make it up to this point here until we have any buckets, and then we'll start continuing and making the lava flow um, a bit more, okay? So let's just open this up here a little bit more, uh, just like this, and boom. And then we'll do fill in this area here, of course, because things can spawn here. Um, I will remove this part here, and we will grab lava and place it right here. Uh, oh, 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 no, 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 I didn't see that. Oh, goodness, it already started flowing all the way over to here. That's crazy. All right, that's good, though. Uh, we got that part, part there. Um, I love being on fire, don't you guys? Just playing. It's not cool. Um, let's go ahead and place that right there. Hopefully, that's going to gonna continue with that there and you know what I'm just gonna go ahead and fill up this wall here I think filling up the wall is not that bad um, and then we'll place the there we go we'll place the lava there okay um, so put this back over here we have a couple more buckets here and then we'll continue working on some of the the more interesting stuff to continue making this work and I can show you guys exactly how I'm gonna do this um, in just one moment let me place that there um, and then I'm going to jump back over here and last two buckets and then we're going to, yeah, then I'll show you exactly what I've been talking about extending everything. So placing that there and damn it, uh, place that there and I'm going to place this here just like this all the way to the top. Make sure that there can't be, yeah, there it is. That's wonderful. And the last bucket will go right here until I have to go down and get some more. All right. Now that we're starting to get this going here, um, there we go. So now we basically need to uh, just remove um, the nether rack. What I'm going to do is actually stay a block away first, right? We're going to stay a block away um, from, hopefully, if I, uh oh, there goes my mouse acting a fool. We're going to stay about a block away from all the lava here. Um, this is the dangerous part. I'm scared to do this part here because one mess up and you'll have a lava pool right underneath your feet. Um, and we'll just go all the way up to about this point here, yeah? Because we still need to place some there. But we'll do this here. And we know this is the, the elevation now, right? That This is basically uh, what we're going to have to remove. Then we'll remove all of this, right? We're going to remove all of this nether brick. And just like this, right? And I'm also doing this so it's a little bit quicker for me. Uh-oh, that, that gas might shoot us and mess us up here. Well, he might, Oh, there's some lava there already for us too. And actually, I can just pick that up. And use that somewhere else. So thank you very much for that. I'm just going to keep removing this here. Um, keep removing this and removing this. Right? Oh, there's some nether... Uh, ooh, should we just pick it up now? I think we should. The quartz is actually... I know I probably missed some here. But I, you know, I'm just trying not to... I'm trying to go fast because I want to show you guys exactly how I want to do this. But I will be picking up all of the quartz that I see. Of course, um, because quartz is very important. And once the lava river or ocean is in, we will never be able to come back here. Um, yeah, once this is in, this is it. It's permanent forever. Um, so it's going to be, yeah, it's going to be a little crazy. All right, now that we removed all that point there or all this here, what we need to do is head back over to this corner. First off, I'm going to eat just in case I do catch on fire. Um, real quick. There we go. Um, and we will remove... Now, underneath it, just like this, like, uh-oh, make sure we get it all, and we, I'm doing it as quick as possible, uh, and getting out of the, the area of the lava, uh-oh, jump right up here, to this point, and that way it should, you see what I'm saying, now it's to this point here, and what I will do is continue doing the same thing again, so, uh, to continue this river here, what we'll need to do, or this, uh, this waterfall, right, right here, and I still have blazes down there, I can't wait till this stuff is in, and they can't mess with us. Um, there we go. That's working there. And then I'll do the same exact thing, guys, until I get this falling off the edge. Like I said, it's going to be a lot of work, but that was, what, 12 buckets? Maybe 24 buckets of lava, and I already got a full area filled in with lava instead of trying to slab it, which would take stacks and stacks and time and, and just a crazy amount of time to do this. So I think I'm going to end up doing... Oh, man, what the hell is this? Is there more back here? Oh, this is crazy. There's more back here that I might have to slab or lava. Oh, my goodness. You know what, though? Okay, I know what I'm going to do here. Oh, I have an idea. I might do like we do with the crusher. 
I might do this. This is what I'm gonna do. Oh man, I didn't even notice this was back here. This sucks. This is what I'm gonna do. I'm going to do, since we're gonna have the lava ocean up here, um, I'm gonna make a walkway, right? Because it has to be slabbed all the way to the end. Oh, this might actually be a pretty good idea. Make this all the way to the end here. Actually, let's do this. Um, I know the episode's probably getting long, but I just wanted to go ahead and show you the idea that just came to me right now. Um... Because what we'll do then, because then we can always get back up here in case we need to check on something or lava. I don't know if lava breaks. Um, but this might actually be a pretty good idea. Hold on. Uh, we'll take this all the way to here. Um, hmm. How do I want to do this? Yep, I want to do it like this. Uh, like this. Is that going to be smart though? I don't know if I'm going to be able to do this. Um, actually, I think I will be able to. Hold on. Let's Let's make this a bit wider. Right? Um, I am using up a bunch of slabs here, but I have an idea that I think will work pretty good. Um, of course, this is actually going to be removed anyway, because we know that the, you know, the elevation is going to have to go lower there for that. So, what we'll do is add in slabs here, right? And slabs here. And I might even remove the, the nether uh, rack underneath there and have the just the lava right underneath this thing. But what we'll do... I don't know if this is smart, guys. You guys can let me know down in the comments what you guys think about all this, of course. Um... But what I'm thinking right now is we'll have this here to come up here and check on the ocean. Because uh, I don't know if that, I don't know how many blocks I am away from there to there, inside of there. If it's more than 140 blocks, then I don't have to worry about this section here. Um, oh, we still have some more. So what I'm thinking is we'll have a way, if I don't have to, if I don't have to worry about uh, putting lava or slabs on that section, we'll have a way... To get back up here because this is going to be completely filled with lava all the way around is going to be lava everywhere and that way we'll have a bridge hopefully to get up and down i'm going to try this real quick um the episode is getting long and i you know i i'm going to try this here real quick guys and then um we'll place that there we'll place this here and we'll do this and this will all be lava here all around here and we'll do like we do like i said for the the wither crusher we'll have a bridge to get over to this side if it's possible i don't know if it is i honestly don't know if this is possible at all um what i am going to do here though is just uh fill in this area here so nothing can spawn and i know it's one block but i, I think magna cubes can can spawn in a one block uh area and that's the reason why i'm filling this in here um all right so we'll leave that as it is for now but what my idea is is this then right once this lava is here and that way we can get in and go check out the other side of this place. Uh, or even, you know, I don't know. But uh, I'm going to try this. So this is like, we have to imagine that everything is filled with lava, including uh, around that bridge there. Because that's the plan. I would shoot that down, down here. And then if I needed to get up here for some reason. Oh, I really can't see that though. I mean, I can see it. Kind of know where it is. I might have to extend it a bit. But hold on. If I toss this out there. Oh, we can get right back on top here without an issue, guys. We can get right back on top here without a freaking issue. Um, and, and come check on the lava and make sure that everything is, is nothing is spawning up here. Oh, I think that's going to be good. All right, so yeah, I'm going to leave that there just like that. And what I need to do and what I'm going to do now is continue doing what I was doing here. Uh, if there's any other holes like that around that I see, I'm going to probably have to do the same thing, to be honest. Um... But what I'm going to do is just continue doing this part here. I want to get this section in. Uh, I will get the rest. Of, well, this section's almost done here. So about 24 buckets and we have basically, and I'm going to actually start just removing all the way up to here. Um, yeah, I, I'm not going to do it right here because I know I'm going to be adding lava in there. But let me just remove all this here. And 24 buckets have basically gotten us up to this point. And that's a lot of blocks that I can see that has been filled up. So I think this might be the better way to do this. Again, guys, if you have a better way um, to do this or you know how to do it, please let me know down in the comments. I don't want to start it from that side. I want to start from this side here. Um, please let me know down in the comments. You guys, you know, are, are better Minecraft players than I am and know better than me. So um, if you know, oh my goodness, can you please get out of the way? I'm busy here. Uh, oh, okay. Oh, oh, no, 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 the damn. Okay, so what I'm going to do is the same thing we just did a second ago. Try to go as quick as possible. Um, like this. There we go. And get out of the way. And then we will continue doing, I'll continue doing the same thing. Oh, it's gonna go. I might have to add a bucket or two somewhere. Uh-oh. I might have to add a bucket somewhere. Um, like right there. I just noticed that it just, right when I said I was gonna add a bucket, 
I might have to add a bucket in certain spots, like right here. I don't know why the hell I just did this. But I'll grab a bucket of lava, place it there, and hopefully it spreads. Well, it didn't spread there. It's not spreading. Oh, there it is. It spread there. If I remove it, will it... No, it's going to dissipate there. Let me go ahead and put that right there. So I might put in some lava in... Oh, and it extends it, actually. So I might end up doing that until we get to the edge right there. And then, of course, I will be removing this here. Uh, so, yeah, I will probably bring more buckets up here and add certain where it needs it. Uh, but I think right now it's doing pretty good what I need it to do. All right, guys, the episode's getting mad long, so I'm going to continue doing this um, lava ocean or river uh, off camera. Hopefully, by the next episode, I will have this all filled in and most of it filled in down there with lava. Uh, but, yeah, uh, it's a lot of work that I need to get on and working on, and hopefully uh, you guys enjoyed and liked uh, the idea here. So let me know what you guys think about everything down in the comments, and I will see you guys in the next one. So there we go, guys. Hopefully you guys enjoyed that, and if you did, please like, comment, and subscribe to that YouTube channel. Don't forget to check out my last video. It's right there in the middle of the screen. Go ahead and click on that. And guys, down in the description is my Facebook, Twitter, and my Google Plus links. Go ahead and follow me there. Again, guys, thank you very much for watching, and I will see you next time. Deuces!